It's a hot day here in central Iowa. Currently in the shop, it's just over 80 degrees. The dew point is also up around 80. The actual temperature outside, I just looked on my phone, is 93. And it's supposed to be 100 degrees at five o'clock. We're supposed to have a heat index up around 110 today. No wind today. Just blue skies, hot sun, extremely sticky and muggy and, and just not a very nice day. I just got back from the P.O. box. I had a couple packages down there and I also had to renew my P.O. box. These are both from the same person which is Ghost Fault and he sent some plates in before. I believe that's what he sent again. Got my knife. Let's see what Ghost Fault had to send. I'm going to open this one first. And we have an envelope inside of an envelope. Get this one open here. And we have three more Michigan plates from Ghost Fall, which will be finding their way up on the wall here. I may not do this today as I'm already starting to sweat to death down here. It is so sticky, it's just terrible. Let's get the second one open. Holy moly. He sent a few here and I'm thankful that they aren't all from the same state. So let's go through these real quick and he, he does write on the back of them sometimes. I know he wrote on the back of this one. Ghost Fault 86, 92 Chevy Silverado 2500 4x4. We'll start with that one. And that is a, it's a different type of Michigan plate. The next one, the same type of plate, um, the 2JC, this is a 3JC, same type of plate there, and another. Found the note, here is a 1976 Bicentennial Michigan plate, I am sweating something terrible. Another one, a 1973 Michigan plate, I guess uh, most of these are from Michigan, but they're all different looking at least, here's a 79. A uh, 2000, I believe. 2003. A Michigan plate from 2002. 2012 Michigan plate. Another 2012 Michigan plate. Two hours later. A 2009 Michigan plate. And last but not least, a 2014. It's oh, it looks like a 2014. Florida plate. So those came from Ghost Ball, and he did have a letter here that he sent with those. And it says, Hi there, Fox Shop Ghost Ball 86 again with 15. I thought you sent 18. I think that package had 15, that one had 18. With 15 license plates for your wall from Florida, 14, one from Florida, 14 from Michigan, two from 76, one from 73, one from 79. And a bunch of others. And a bunch of others I collected for you to enjoy. One being from my dad's 1992 Chevy 2500 HD when he got new plates. Hope you had a good holiday weekend with your family, Ghost Fault 86. And this will be going up on the board. I need to get a new cork board. I keep forgetting about that. One of the latest letters up there is from Ghost Fault, in fact. Thank you very much. I will be getting these up on the wall, but I don't think I'm going to do it today as it's just getting too darn hot. I know I said the temperature in here is just over 80 degrees, but it is so hot and sticky out today. 
It's a swamp. Not actually doing a lot today. I haven't actually been doing anything for the past week or so. It's just been too darn hot. We're supposed to, like I said, we're supposed to have a heat index up towards 110 today and tomorrow. Then a little cool down over the weekend and then I think it's supposed to ramp up again. So I haven't been doing a whole heck of a lot down here in the shop. But there is something fairly big coming to the channel. Um, as far as the truck goes, there really isn't anything at the moment that needs done with the exception of... With the exception of, and you can't really even see it, there, the power steering pump down there. Which, if you remember a few videos back, I did replace that pump. But the darn thing is, uh, it's, it's a little noisy. It's noisier than the old one. I thought maybe it would work its way out of it. That's hot. It's not. And I think I'm going to have to do something different. If anybody knows of pumps that would mount right up that are quiet, or a way to make these quieter, which I don't think there really is, it's just how these old Ford pumps are, Leave it in the comments below. But I've been looking at the Saginaw pumps um, online, and if you can find one that looks like an old van or something like that, you can get the pump and the bracket and everything, and it'll mount right up. May have to make a trip down to the salvage yard, see what I can find. I hate to get one mounted all up, find out that it's a piece of junk. But, but the way this thing moans and groans and whines, and it doesn't do it all of the time, but it does it periodically, uh, especially when you're like turning in a parking lot or something like that and I don't like it So we're gonna have to find a way to quiet this thing down While I was on the subject a minute ago. Look at that pile of plates 18 more To go up here somewhere And if you have a license plate or anything else Saginaw pump that you would like to send to the Fox shop the address is in the description below. I probably should have come in here to do mail time. Haven't really been doing anything in here lately. Could have got the air conditioner going. And there's that old 1917 plate. And just walking in here, it's quite a bit cooler than it is out there. So it probably would have been nice. I figured by the time I got the air conditioner on and it cooled it down in here, I could be done. But uh, so as far as what's coming up on the channel, the thing I mentioned earlier that's kind of going on behind the scenes, I really can't go into detail too much on it. It shouldn't be too long. I was supposed to have a phone call yesterday, which didn't happen. We're setting it up for another time. So I'm not exactly sure when this thing might probably within the next two, three, maybe four weeks, somewhere right in that time frame. Should bring some really good content to the channel, lots of content to the channel, along with some great information. I can tell you, I think it's something you're not going to find anywhere else if you do maybe one or two other spots, but I don't think you're going to see it anywhere else, so stay tuned for that. Gonna be 90 in here shortly. So no, I don't have a lot for you today. It's just been too darn hot out to be doing much of anything. So just a little update video for you. I do plan on getting more videos out. Hopefully this big thing that I keep talking about yet can't talk about is going to happen. Maybe I can give you a little more info on when as soon as I find out. And don't forget I also have t-shirts and hoodies if you care to purchase such a thing, it's I'll leave the link down below. Also, it seems like a lot of people liked the little videos I did up at the cabin. If you like that kind of thing, let me know down below and I'll try to get more of that type of thing. So just a little update video for you. Uh, not really a lot to update at the moment. But give this video a thumbs up, comment down below, subscribe if you haven't already, and we'll catch you next time. I'm heading to the house. Bye-bye. We bop and hippity hop I'm as happy as I can be uh,